Hi, and welcome to Paper Root Scrapbooking. I'm Nadine, it's Thrifty Thursday, and I found a few goodies this week. Okay, so um, as I spoke about in my, um, let's see, my March haul video where I showed everything that I purchased for the month of March for my scrappy space. Um, I said that I hadn't done any thrift shopping in the month of March and that I was hoping to go later this week. So here we are. And I did find a couple of things this week. So I found this little um, treasure on a Facebook marketplace for a few dollars and it is a Rolodex. Now, I don't know if anybody else has heard of this trend, but over on Ginger's Corner, one of the new things that they're bringing about is a memory deck swap. And I hadn't done this before. I hadn't thought of it before. I hadn't, I've seen it kind of a little bit here and there, but um, anyways, basically it's like people are making these memory decks cards and they are so stinking cute. And they are, there's like fancy scrapbooky Rolodex thingies that you can buy called memory decks. But I found this little puppy on Facebook Marketplace for a couple dollars and thought, you know what, let me give this a try. So essentially I'm going to get rid of all of this stuff that's already on here. And I am going to um, start making some memory decks cards and popping them on here. And then we will see, I'll do some trading in the swaps. And then maybe if I like it, I will start adding photos and such and maybe make a little... Um, memory album that sits on the desk and you turn it and you see the things and I think it would be really cute as a gift. So that's what I'm thinking with this. So I thought, you know what, I'm going to join in the memory deck swaps and give that a whirl. So I found that. And then I also went to a thrift shop, only one. I haven't had a lot of time for shopping this week, but, um, and I found this, uh, it is a, I want to say light bulb but it's like a Christmas bulb I guess shaped and so I thought this would be cute for a few different things so I'm going to I, I thought I'll buy it for a few dollars and then I will take it home and I'll use it a bit and then when I tire of it I'll get rid of it but um, it's from a company that I never heard of before to imagination and I don't know what that tiny print says yeah no idea so um, but it looks like an older one. It kind of looks like those Marby punches. And I like that it has this like containment thing so you don't make a big mess with all your stuff. But yeah, I thought this might be fun to add for swaps or um, to my Christmas layouts. So I'm gonna add that to my um, supplies. And I know I've talked about this before, but I'm really trying to only bring in things that I like tools and albums and page protectors and that sort of thing. So I consider this kind of like an album, right? Tool, album. Um, I will buy things if I think that they're worth my money, if I think I, if I know what I'm gonna use them for. Um, yeah, so, but this is what I found this week. So this is an album. It is a three ring album from Becky Higgins. I checked inside. It's pretty neat and tidy on the inside. It's got this very sturdy um, center piece and all of the binder rings match up. So those are the things that I usually check for. Now this one did have some warping um, that I saw right away when I picked it up on the cover. But I think that, and I can feel it, like the cardboard obviously got bent at some point. So um, I'm going to try to bend it back a little bit. I also think though that once all of my pages are on here and it's on a shelf, like so, nobody's going to notice. And look at the price, $2.99. So um, anytime I find an album that is a three ring binder for under $5, like $5 or less, I try to pick it up because um, these are the ones that I use for, the, the ones that are like mismatched like this that I, you know, I like to have. All of my Christmas ones in red. I like, you know, like I have like idea, like, anyway. I like my travel ones to all be different because every trip is different and they all give different experiences. So anyways, that's all I found this week. And um, 
I so hope that everybody is having a really good week and I um, yeah I really appreciate you being here thanks so much for hanging out with me if you have any questions or comments please leave them down below and I'll go back to you just as soon as I can have a great day everyone bye for now